Efforts to get kids vaccinated continued apace on Friday, the first day of the Dragon Boat Festival holiday. In Taipei, big crowds gathered at local schools as parents brought their children in for the Pfizer vaccine. Throughout the three-day-long weekend, seven large-scale vaccination clinics will offer child vaccination in all six special municipalities. On the first day of the holiday, Shuzi Elementary School hosted a vaccine clinic for children. A crowd formed at the school early in the morning. I came to wait here at 7 a.m. The reason we're getting this done early is that this way, we have a two-day recovery period. If we waited till Saturday or Sunday, we'd have to deal with the side effects on a weekday. Originally, the doctors at our partner clinic were scheduled to be on leave. However, to help our school, they came in today for the vaccination clinic. Friday was the final day of on-campus Pfizer vaccinations in Taipei. Children who miss out can still get their shot at Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall, where a large-scale clinic launched on Wednesday. Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall will vaccinate children throughout the long weekend. On Friday, families began trickling in after 9 in the morning. Online booking started out slow earlier this week, but by Friday, more than 1,000 children were registered to get their shot. By the end of the day, the clinic expects to vaccinate some 1,500 children, including walk-ins. On a visit to Chiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall, Taipei Deputy Mayor Tsai bing Quinn criticized the central government for opening the clinic too early while school vaccinations were still underway. He said the new clinic was a waste of manpower and that the central government did not coordinate its plans with local officials. The first two days were superfluous, frankly speaking, because we had already set up school vaccinations. And here they were, opening up another vaccination clinic that led to the waste of medical resources. But the new clinic does provide much-needed support over the three-day-long weekend. When it came to the timing of the launch, the central government could have given us a phone call. That probably would have solved the problem. The deputy mayor said that as of Thursday, 52 percent of the city's eligible children have been vaccinated. He said schools will reopen for physical classes next Monday as scheduled.